Hi, welcome back to Kolsky Drones. So I want to do a quick revisit on the Hubson Zeno. So at the end of this video you're going to see the video footage with all the latest firmware. Latest firmware for this flight controller, latest firmware for the camera and the gimbal. So it's all the latest firmware. They have they fixed the issues? Sort of. So the camera looks less soft. It still is slightly soft in my opinion. The video you're going to see is not filmed in the brightest of days. And you can tell probably more now that it's not as ha uh, it's still a bit soft. But you can have to with the only on the flip side of that, it was a bad day to film. However, you're still going to see that the screen occasionally goes flashes one colour. It goes purple. That's an issue this has had from day one. Not everybody seems to have it. I think it depends where you are, what kind of lighting conditions you're in. But it should be sorted by now. End of. They should have sorted it. The flying characteristics, is it any better than it was originally? No, not in my opinion. The hover might be very slightly better, but it, if it is better, it's very slight. So when I did this original review, I think I wanted it to be better than it is, if I'm to being totally honest. I thought it was good value for money because there was nothing else at this price point. So that's still the case. There's nothing at this price point to match this. But now we've got the Xiaomi A8 coming out, the Fimi Xiaomi A8 made by Xiaomi, which boasts far better spec than this, and it does boast 100 megabits per second video transfer rate. Whether that is, comes to fruition, I don't know, and a really good flight time. If that's the case, this thing is not going to be anywhere near the ballpark. So if I'm being totally honest, would I recommend buying this now? No, I don't think I would. I think. They need, these bugs should have been ironed out and it's extremely annoying they brought this to market with loads of bugs still in it. I can fly this fine and I do enjoy flying it. But if I'm recommending this to someone to buy as their first drone or a decent camera drone then it falls short. I've been trying to contact Hudson customer support for about two weeks. Virtually impossible to. They, they will never respond to the emails. Either they don't care, or they've got that many people complaining or going on about different issues, they haven't got the time to deal with it. Whatever the case, it's not very good and it's certainly not professional. So you're going to see the video. Like I say, it may sound like I'm talking every which way because I'm saying that I like flying it, and I do. But for my, when I'm reviewing a drone, I'm recommending it to other people, and I can't recommend this anymore. Because I thought the bugs would have been ironed out by now, and they haven't. They've had... I think it's four soft and four firmware upgrades. In my opinion, they just don't really know what they're doing. They just need to get someone involved that knows what they're doing that can put this right. They asked me for feedback on faults. I've sent them feedback on faults. They haven't responded. They haven't even bothered, so they don't really care. And the one big thing about this that you're never going to fix is the controller is utter garbage. The resolution on the sticks is appalling. It's a gamepad controller, and it feels like I may as well go get my PlayStation 4 joypad and bind it to it but I think the PlayStation 4 joypad probably got a better resolution than the sticks so rant over and like I say I still do enjoy flying this but you've got to be able to fly kind of thing if you know what I mean I wouldn't it certainly wouldn't recommend this for a beginner because it's ten, it's got some tendencies to drop its altitude when you're flying it so let's see what the Xiaomi A8 looks like when it comes out and indeed the A4 that's coming out for the 1080p video on this is nothing to write home about either so let's see what that 1080p version is. Thanks ever so much for watching, have a fantastic day.